students so let's start answer in short question number c short and precise lesson number one chemistry standard sixth so first question is state the main aim of alchemy so for that you will write alchemy aimed at finding philosopher's stone which was considered to turn the base metals into gold okay Put a full stop and this is the complete answer. Now come to the second question. How did Mendeleev use the modern periodic table of elements? So you will write the answer. Mendeleev used the table to predict the existence and properties of new chemical elements. Okay. Full stop. Answer complete. Then third question. What are food preservatives? Now here you have to define food preservatives. So, you'll write the chemicals used to preserve food and control its wastage are known as food preservatives. You can write two examples here also, sugar and salt. Fourth number question. Why do we use sugar and salt often to preserve food? So, you'll write the answer. Sugar and salt are used to preserve food as they help in preventing the growth of bacteria in food items. Okay, now next question, what are processed foods? Give examples. So, you will write, food processing refers to the process of transforming raw materials into physical or chemical methods into marketable food products. Such food products are called processed food. Okay, for example, jam, jelly, cheese, etc. Put a full stop. Now come to the next question. What are cosmetics? Give examples. So you'll write, cosmetics are substances that enhance the appearance of external parts of human body. Example, skin cleansers, lipsticks, shampoos, soaps, talcum powders, etc. So you can give any two examples. Then at length question. Question number A, explain the following terms. A number, chemistry. So, we'll write, chemistry is the branch of science which deals with the study of substances. Second number, alchemists. So, you'll write, people who practiced alchemy were called alchemists. Third one, preservatives. So, we have already defined food preservatives. So, same definitions you can write. The chemicals used to preserve food and control its wastages are called food preserve, preservatives. Again, same question. Food, preserve, uh, food preservation. Think food processing. Sorry. So, the question is food processing. So, you will write the definition. The process of transforming raw food materials by physical or chemical methods into methods into marketable food products. Okay. Now, come to question number B. Differentiate the following. Science and chemistry. So, you will just write the definition of both. So, science refers to the knowledge attained through study or practice. Whereas, Chemistry is a branch of physical science, deals with the study of composition and properties of substances and, this is and, short form of and, how they react when combined with one another. You can add one more sentence in the definition of science. It has two main parts or branches, that is physical science and natural science. Okay, so now let's, uh, that will be the complete definition of science. Then you will write the definition of chemistry. Then let's see B number, preservatives and processed foods. So both definitions we have written earlier. I'm just repeating. Preservatives are chemicals used to preserve food and control its wastage. Example, sugar and salt. And processed food you will write. The food products that are made suitable for consumption, cooking and storage by physical or chemical methods 
are called as processed food okay then next one natural fibers and synthetic fibers so we'll right natural fibers are obtained from natural sources like plants animals insects etc so you'll write natural sources like plants animals insects etc and you will write for example cotton silk and wool and synthetic fibers are made from chemical substances these fibers are strong wrinkle resistant and dry quickly for example nylon and terrile then come to this next question that is uh, i think answers in detail okay c number write a note uh, that is a c number answer in uh, detail okay so write a note on alchemy so you can write alchemy was an early philosophical and spiritual field of study that integrated chemistry with metalwork full stop the people who practiced alchemy were called alchemists their work contributed in laying foundation of modern chemistry and medicine it is a physical aspect uh, it's sorry it's uh, it's physical aspect was the experimental study of transformation of base metals into gold it aimed at finding philosopher's stone and produce elixir of life they also designed laboratory equipments such as balances for weighing chemicals and invented apparatus for distilling liquids this much you will write then write about the contributions of anton lavoisier so you will write lavoisier is credited for discovering the role of oxygen in combustion he also gave the law of conservation of mass he also named oxygen and hydrogen then dimitri mendeleev so you will write he formulated modern periodic table of elements and used it to predict the existence and properties of new chemical elements okay you, there is no need to write about the um, birth and other details only what he did this much you will write okay full para no need to write three number how has chemistry helped to meet the increased demand of food due to an increased population so right as increased population led to an increased demand for food chemistry has helped in preservation of food in order to prevent wastage and make it available to its customers okay then four number right how chemistry uh, plays an important role in the development of cosmetics so you'll write chemistry plays a significant role in the development of cosmetics uh, as all the cosmetics are made from the combination of various chemical ingredients for example eg is the short form of for example lipsticks are made from a combination of oils waxes pigments or colors and emollients emollients are actually skin softeners okay the next one write the role of chemistry in medicine so you'll write the first line from page number 8 the knowledge of chemistry has helped in discovering a vast range of new medicines antibiotics such as penicillin and ampicillin are used to treat infections this much then drug discovery and development is driven by the knowledge of chemistry of various molecules and how they are associated with life process therefore we can say that chemistry plays the most significant role in the development of drugs and continues to strengthen the growth of ph uh, pharmaceutical industries so this much you will write okay so this much now let us see the next one that is uh, this one observe and perform so this is your homework and apply your learning is also your homework now let's come to the next one that is the last one review your learning so 
an early philosophical and spiritual field of study that has made a significant contribution of modern science that is alchemy a mythical and magical substance that is philosopher's stone then the process of transforming raw materials into physical or chemical method into marketable food products that is food processing a food preservative used in food products beverages and sal uh, salads that is sodium benzoate then substances that promote attractiveness without affecting body structure and function that is cosmetics the new discoveries and inventions in science have made our life more comfortable that's true physical processes take place to new, uh, produce uh, numerous uh, useful substances that is false then the work of alchemists contribute uh, in laying the foundation for modern chemistry that is true all the cosmetics that we use today are made from combination that is true the uh, natural fibers are strong wrinkle resistance and dry quickly that is false then match the columns dimitri mendeleev modern periodic table d number lavoisier e number john dalton a number niels bohr five num uh, sorry bohr atomic model ans rutherford gold uh, gold foil experiments so you can match from here okay see so rutherford found the gold foil experiment Niels Bohr Bose model and John Dalton modern atomic theory see from here also okay then the next two questions so the last two questions uh, of this one explain the following terms and question number e is your homework okay this much for today we'll discuss uh, chapter uh, elements compounds and mixtures in the next video